Construction and engineering has been in the spotlight following the collapse of that multi-story building being built in George. As of this afternoon, 33 people had been confirmed killed, 19 still unaccounted for, more than 60 have been rescued. Well, in the better news, the Steel and Engineering Industries Federation of South Africa, SIFSA, has concluded a historic three-year wage agreement with union NUMSA. SIFSA affiliated members account for 57 percent of all employees in the steel and engineering industries employers rather to discuss we're joined by Lucio Trentini from Sifsta the CEO thank you Mr. Trentini can we start with your comment on George even if uh, Sifsta its members have no involvement have you been horrified watching at what has been playing out no, it's been absolutely devastating and our hearts go out to all the families that have loved ones are still waiting for their bodies to be recovered and for family that have lost members, um, it's a tragedy and we hope that those responsible um, are quickly found and brought to book. I mean, this should never have happened. It's really unfortunate and it's tragic that it did and um, it's, there, there are no words to express the devastation that this has caused um, to the people on that site. So we are, we are deeply, deeply troubled and, uh, our, and, and we pass our sympathies on uh, to those that are directly affected. You would have had the developer and the owner of the land and then contractors. We've received the, the full list. Uh, but what is your comment on general standards in development in, in building? So I mean, as you correctly um, framed CIFSA, CIFSA is the Steel and Engineering Industries Federation. We don't represent employers in the civil engineering industry. Our sister body does, um, the South African Federation of Civil Engineers. And I'm absolutely sure and certain that they are troubled by what happened in George and they are looking into it. And um, I, I, I guess, you know, they would be the, the proper body um, to ask these questions.